up everyone welcome back here to another amazing video i'm in mombasa kenya and guys it is too noisy here a lot of tuk tuk <laughs> but i'm loving it i'm experiencing it this brings back kampala vibes guys so i'm going to be experiencing exploring this beautiful city in kenya on the coast and i have my brother he's going to be taking me around bro Come, 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 drum rolls, yeah! What's good, guys? Yeah, this man. is Samuel Travel in History, and I have a YouTube channel by the name Samuel Travel in History, mm. and I'm honored and privileged to meet you my brother here, connect. my brother here from Uganda, and we're going to be exploring Mombasa. Mombasa. And give you the whole vibe of Mombasa, the experience, what you need to know before coming to Mombasa. Yeah. Sure, you're going to enjoy this episode. M7, 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 you know M7. <laughs> <laughs> Here in Mombasa, Kenya. This is how cassava crepes are prepared. The cassava crepes. <laughs> so guys, this is my first impression of Mombasa City. Mombasa City. But man, it is very busy here, very busy. Yeah, today is on a weekend. Wow. And uh, today is Friday. Yeah, yeah. Saturday. Oh, yeah, today is Saturday. Okay. Being on a Saturday, mm. most people wanna go out and hang out, and uh, most of the people are not at work. They just want to bring out their cars, go to Mamangina. Okay. Yeah, and uh, what is Mamangina? Mamangina is a uh, Waterfront whereby people just chill. Okay. Yeah, I think we can go over there. It's on the coast? Yeah, it's around uh, the island. Oh, the island? Is yeah. it close by from here? Yeah, it's close by. Yeah, let's go. Why not? Yeah, we are going to go there. <laughs> let's go and check it out. Yeah. So, is so, it okay stepping here? Yeah, it's okay. Oh, it's a carpet? Yeah, it's a carpet. I thought it is natural grass. Ah, uh, no. So, this uh, carpet was placed by the former governor of Mombasa mm. as a way of uplifting the face of Mombasa. Yes, yes, So yes. then they put these lights and stuff. So they light up at night? Yeah, it's very, it's, it looks amazing at night. Wow. Yeah. Why not grass? Why didn't they plant grass? Uh, I'm not sure why they, they, they opted to go for artificial glass, mm. but... Grass like this, natural? Yeah. They didn't replace it with the... They just decided to use the artificial one, but... Okay. Yes. Man, it is so, so busy. So, right here, we are at uh, Mwembe Tayali. This is where people just, like, where we have come from. That is Mwembe Tayali, whereby people just uh, light mm. uh, matatus when they come out from... From uh, Nairobi. From Nairobi or any other part of the country. That is the arrival point. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. <laughs> Oh my god. Sorry, sorry. So oh my I wanna god. take you to the other side. This and then side? maybe yeah that side I show you a little history about Mombasa. Okay, let's then, go. Uh, we continue to explore Mombasa. Okay, no problem. Yo, what's up bro? Last <laughs> time uh, So guys, tell me if you're enjoying the video. I'm really loving it here. Very, very amazing, man. Oh, here? Yeah, just a moment. Oh, yeah, Buddha. 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 Ah, no. I think it, it's, a, it's a free site for tourists. Yeah, it's a free site. He's so, asking for money. Yeah, he's asking for money. So yeah. this, this is to the memory of the Arab and the native African troops who fought for the, uh, the career, who were the feet and the hands of the army. Okay. So people, you can show people so that they can read about this one. Okay. So these are the, to commemorate the soldiers who fought for the First World War, 1914-1918. Okay. Oh. Yep. Okay. Nice. So, 
So you can show them here. So this is basically the whole information about this place. Mm. Uh, it's uh, controlled by National Museum of Kenya. Mm. Yeah, under the Ministry of uh, Culture and Heritage. And tourism? Yeah, and tourism. Okay. So this one is written in Swahili. Mm. And this one is written in English. In English? Yeah, so... With you basically know Mombasa, most of the people speak Swahili here yeah, in the yeah, coastal yeah, region. Yeah. So they have to at least be so lenient with everyone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So English and Swahili and also for the tourists too. Yeah. Yeah. So interesting. I've seen on the other side there is also Arabic. Yeah, there is also Arabic. It looks like Arabic is a popular language here. Yeah, most of the people who are in Mombasa are Muslims and mm. they speak Arabic. Oh. Yeah. Okay. So that's basically uh, what uh, you have to see around here. Yeah, about yeah. that monument. About that monument. All right. Yeah, and maybe you know, maybe people be, may be asking, oh, how did Mombasa came to develop? How did Mombasa came about? Uh huh. Yeah, so Mombasa, uh, there are two people who are the initiators of Mombasa. Mm. The there founders. Is, the founders. Mm. There is Moana, Kisha. Mm. and Shehe. So those are the two Why people. are these ones holding sticks? They're just doing their own thing. Yeah? Are they beating the, people? No, <laughs> they're just doing their own thing. You know, every town, every market has its own. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I don't want to finish that name. <laughs> so I was saying there were those two custodians of Mombasa. Mm. And then initially it was not called Mombasa. It was called Mumbasa. Mu? Mumbasa. M U. Oh, Mu. Yeah, Mumbasa. Okay. Yeah, and then it started as a trade between the East African coast mm. and the Arabs who are coming to East Africa to bring things like spices, mm. uh, collecting of slaves, yeah. and sort and sort and sort. Yes. Yeah, Mombasa has a huge history. Mm. Yes. Wow, that's interesting, bro. So how did they change the name from Mu? M U to M O Mombasa. Mombasa because of the 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 okay the, when the Portuguese came mm. and the British they could not be able to pronounce Mu. Oh. They said Mo. Mo. So it ended up being changed to mm. Mombasa. Oh, I'm seeing a performer there. <laughs> you have seen a, at the entrance. Uh, at the entrance. Yeah. Yeah. People are just being entertained so that they can go and buy things there. Oh. Yeah, so this is now. This is basically what happens on a Saturday mm. or on a Friday during on a weekend. Yeah. Whole lot of vibes, entertainment. Mm. There, so Mombasa is very very busy over the weekend. Over the weekend. Yes. Mm. Yeah. During the weekdays, it is a bit relaxed. Yeah, it's a bit relaxed. Oh. Wow. You know, and then, remember, it's when it's on a weekend, people have come from Nairobi too. What is this? This one is a chali made from mango. Oh, with pilipili. With pilipili. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> made from mango. How much is that? I think maybe 50 shillings. If 50 I'm not bob, eh? Yeah. We, can we find some there? Yeah, As I, we are moving, eh? Yeah, we I can. I want to try it out. Okay. Isn't it so hot? For me, I don't think it's hot because <laughs> I'm used to it. <laughs> but maybe for you, you might find it, oh, okay. a little bit hot. Okay, I'm going to try it. It's here. No, this hey, bro. Is, this one is uh, kashata. Kashata. What is kashata? Kashata is made from uh, coconut. Oh, no, I want for mango. No, no, that one is not from mango. That one is coconut. So it has different varieties, eh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mombasa is a cocktail of different kind of foods. Wow. Influenced by Arabs, mm. Swahili people, mm. uh, this some uh, Chinese descent, mm. remnants of British and okay. Portuguese. Oh, so it's a mixture of different cultures. Yes. And uh, cultures of people. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was going to say races, but some people are not comfortable with that word. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. 
I love the entrepreneurial spirit here. Yes. I love the entrepreneurial spirit here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, there are a hey, lot hey. of businessmen. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, people, people are just... Uh, another thing, the funny thing is, mm. most people even don't set up big businesses, like massive businesses. Hey. They have small, 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 small businesses. But they are profitable. But they are profitable. Like this one. Like these ones. You, s you see, people are selling socks, mm. jewels. Yeah. Watches, but is this pure gold? Ah, no, nah. no, nah. <laughs> why, why should I lie? Why, why should I lie? It's non pure. Ah. Uh. So, we're gonna okay, we close the road over to the other side. Then, yeah, me, I'm following you, bro. You're following me, so. yeah. Let me show you where we are going to go. But it's very hard to cross here. No, they are going to give us space so that we can cross the road. So they are going to give us way. Yeah. We just need to cross, eh? We just need to cross. <laughs> just like in Kampala. Ah. <laughs> hey, Kampala is crazy. <laughs> You've been to Kampala before? Hey, wey. Kampala is crazy. <laughs> but it's more crazy here, bro. No. But you know, the hey. thing is, in Kampala, uh, no, in Kenya, these people will give you space way. to cross. Even in Uganda, they will give you a... They will give you away. Yeah. Hey, but hey. <laughs> otherwise, you would have come back to Kenya when you're dead if they knocked you. <laughs> they would have knocked you down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you should know that Mombasa is probably predominantly Muslim town. Mm. So don't uh, be worried when you see Muslim people around here and mm. this. Uh, uh, people wearing like Wibui, Kurta. Yeah, Sharia. Uh, yeah. Right now, especially, I think it's player time. Mm. Yeah. yeah, I've heard the, 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 the prayer. Yeah. Yeah. They call for prayer. They're calling for prayer. Mm. Wow. So we close. Where is the the famous uh, ponds? I'll Are they take you there. Okay. Ponds. Yeah. Because if you come to Mombasa and you go you, and you don't go there, uh, you didn't visit Mombasa. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Hey, sorry, sorry, it's okay. Let's go. This. Um. Okay. I think let's first go to the tasks. Okay. Yeah, yeah. 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 Let's go to the tasks and then we go to Mamangina because yeah, okay. time. Yeah. When you go to Old Town, mm. it's a it's very huge. And it entails a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. Mm. Yeah. So we can just create maybe 20 minutes for Old Town. Mm. And then now you can enjoy the tasks and then the Mamangina. Okay, no problem. Yes. Yeah, I still have time. I'm not rushing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I'm not rushing anywhere. Yeah, so guys, we are exploring the street of Mombasa. Mm. So. I hope you're enjoying. Yeah, they must be enjoying the video. The video. Yeah, it's very, very amazing. First of all, how are you finding, like, okay, being the first time that you have visited Mombasa, hey. is there anything you have seen unique? Yeah, the building, the architecture uh -huh. has an Arabic, Influence. Indian influence. Yeah. Arabic, now, Indian. Yeah, now that one, now you're going to see it at its purest in old town oh seriously yeah. yeah wow 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 the buildings eh? yeah okay they have different architectural designs from omans arabs mm. the local people mm. and yeah and that so on and so on and all the buildings are old eh? yeah the, most of them are old mm. but the government or municipality have been uh, refurbishing them oh renovating then, them yeah okay and you, you notice that they have been painted blue and mm. white. That's another thing that you <laughs> should a, notice. It's a city known for blue and white. White, yeah. The blue and white city. Yeah, to represent the sky. Oh, yeah. And the, and the water. And the water. Oh, yes. Interesting. Interesting, guys. 
But the tuk-tuks are very noisy. Aye, aye, aye. Very many. Aye, that is one thing. So is this allowed? He's no, crossing no. over. Yeah? It's just do, it's, <laughs> this is crazy. They just do they, they don't observe the traffic rules. <laughs> Guys, you see that? <laughs> Everyone is rushing, rushing, rushing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, in Uganda we have many border borders. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But they are not so noisy like the tuk-tuks. Yeah, yeah, I know more uh, Uganda for motorbikes. Yeah, border, we call them border borders. Border borders. Yeah. So you can see the, the beautification around Mombasa. Yeah, is this recent? No, no, this is not recent. Hashtag Mombasa. Uh, it's been here for a while. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, 20, 20 pale. 20 pamoja. 20 pamoja. We walk, we move. Yeah. This looks like an old building. Yeah. This looks like an old building. Yeah, it's an old building. Mm. Yeah. So you can notice the... Uh, there aren't many high rises in Mombasa. Yeah, 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 yeah. Why? Why though? I think it's because uh, since from the time memorial, yeah. people were building houses like two, three, or four floors, stories. Eh? Yeah, and then they were done. They are done. So starting to demolish the houses and building high rises mm. is going to to be more complex, and maybe there. The County Council of Mombasa is trying to maintain the originality of oh, Mombasa. Of the city. Yeah, of the city. What they need to do, I think, huh? they just have to beautify the streets. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And also work on the maintenance. On the maintenance. Yeah. Yes. And it's, we cannot say it's not that, okay, but it's fine. Yeah, Mombasa is beautiful. Yes. It's a beautiful city. For me, I'm impressed already. <laughs> yeah, I'm loving it. We're loving it. Yeah, look at those buildings. Yeah. Now, those are very old. Yeah, buildings are very old. Uh, as mm. Some of them you'll find they are over 300 years. Are you serious? Over 100 years. Are you serious? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. So this is a bank? No, this is a supermarket, Naivas. Naivas saves you money. Saves you money. Okay. So, do you have uh, Naivas in... Kampala or no. Uganda? No, we don't have it. Okay. Mm. We have Tuskies. Tuskies. Oh, yeah. ta okay. Tuskies here in Kenya. Yeah. I think maybe because it's, I think, I don't know if it's management or whatever. Close happens. business? Yeah, they closed down. They sold it to another. I think even in Uganda they closed maybe. Yeah, they sold it to another okay. company. But are they, is the branch still still working as Tuskies or another branch? Another branch. Oh. So we got like to brand, close. the name brand. Yeah, they did. The name they, Tuskies. Did they change it? Yeah, they did. Okay. Now you know they, they had to sell all Tuskies outlets. Okay. Yeah. So I don't know. I think maybe uh, Quick Mart is the one. No, uh, no, wait, wait. Yeah, I think Quick Mart. Quick Mart. The one that took over the Tuskies. Okay. So. Let's cross so we cross? Back. Yeah, we cross. So that one means mm. Mombasa is a coffee city. Oh, this monument here? Yeah. Okay. So wherever you're in Mombasa, mm. you'll have to at least have a cup of coffee. coffee. Chai. Chai. They don't call so it... So is this a tap? A water is, pipe? Yeah, yeah. A hydro something. For emergency, like maybe if there is outbreak of fire or oh, something. Oh, on the streets. Yes, streets. So they use that one. They just connect a pipe. Pipe. And then? A horse pipe. Horse pipe. Man. Bro, this is beautiful. The white. The white make, and blue. The white makes the city sparkle. Sparkle, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Does it rain here? It is very, very hot. Yesterday it was the, raining. Does even it rain the, oftenly? The whole of this... Month it has been raining, mm. it's been raining all the time. But it's very hot than it's very humid uh, than Nairobi. It's very humid. You know we're on the ocean. Yeah, near the ocean. Mm. Yeah, on a low altitude. Oh yeah, 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 yes. The low altitude. Wow. Guys, let us know what you think about Mombasa, Kenya. Yeah. If you are enjoying the video, kindly give it a thumbs up. 
yeah. and leave your thoughts in the comment section down below about Mombasa. Mombasa. How do you find it compared to your city? Those watching from Kampala, Uganda, how do you find it compared to Kampala, Uganda? Yeah. Nairobi, Nairobi. and other cities around the world. Yep. Leave your thoughts in the comment section down yeah. below. Yeah, because each and every city has its own unique attributes. Yeah, exactly. Yes. So guys, also don't forget to subscribe to my brother's YouTube channel. I really appreciate that. Say the channel again, bro. Samuel Travel and History. All right. Yeah. You'll find amazing travel and history vlogs over there. Mm. You are truly historian. <laughs> so I'm going to be leaving his channel link in the comment section down below. Yeah. And also in the description. Hey, the sun is sunning. The sun yeah. is sunning. Huh? Yeah, we are facing the direction of the sun. It yes. is too bright. Yeah. It's very bright. So, so is this one is a, a, a showroom. Bond? Oh, they sell cars here? Yeah, they sell cars here. Oh, I need to make a car video in Mombasa. In Mombasa. How car prices are here? Are cars cheaper here? I think it all depends with the type of car you want. But generally, compared think, to Nairobi prices? I don't think Mombasa... You know, most of the people come from Nairobi to buy cars here. Well, that means they are cheaper? They are cheaper, yeah. Yeah, I think I have to make a video about them. Yeah, yep. <laughs> because yep. in Uganda, uh -huh. when I make videos about cars, uh -huh. people watch them a lot. Oh. They like them so much. They like more about motors. Yeah, 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 yeah. They love so, motors. So is this like the, the uptown or downtown? This one, let's say... Uh, do I call it? Pole Kazi, Pole Kazi. Yeah. <laughs> do I call it? No. I... Is this the uptown, downtown? I think there is no downtown or uptown in Mombasa. Cause Are you like, serious? Because like <laughs> everywhere it's almost all the same same almost the same because lights near here this you'll find so many businesses like uh, banks hotels showrooms mm. so this is like the uptown if there are banks it's like the uptown yeah. and i and see no, there are not many tuk-tuks here yeah and also there is uh, this is also a touristic area because of the pembes and of what the mombasa tasks yeah the tasks sir huh? yeah oh i can see them i can, I can see them, see them. So it goes up to the ocean? This one is not going to go take you direct to the ocean because mm. you have to take a matatu from here all the way to Kilindini Harbor. And uh, how long is that in uh, kilometers? I'm not sure. Mm. I'm, let me say I'm not sure about that. But usually how much does it cost the matatu to from Kilindini Harbor? Uh, maybe at most 50 shillings. At 50 most. Bob. Yeah. Yeah, those watching in Uganda, 50 bob is like 1,000. Oh, okay. 500. Me... <laughs> you were saying 0. Point. <laughs> 0. Point. No, I was Kenyan counting shilling it. is uh, big, man. Uh, when, ay, ay, ay. No, now when I go to Uganda, it will be a... Uh, you will be in 0. Point. <laughs> I'll be a... Uh, uh, you will be a millionaire. I'll be a millionaire. <laughs> if you go to Uganda yeah. with, um, let me say, 20,000 Kenyan, uh -huh. you will be a millionaire. Whoa. 20,000 and above. Wow, you'll be a millionaire. Because I came with a half a million. Mm -hmm. Okay, the first exchange I changed here was half a million. Uh -huh. But I only got 13,000. <laughs> and later on, I had so, to get more money because it wasn't enough for me. <laughs> wow, wow. So let's say maybe I go to Uganda maybe with like 10,000 Kenya shillings. Mm. How much does that equate in Ugandan shillings? Um, that one is around, I think, 400,000 or 300,000. 270 to 350,000. So, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, it's little money. It's very little. So, I'm thinking, I'm, no, I wonder how. Uh, let me, hey, I'm trying to. Uh, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Hey. <laughs> yeah, our currency. It's not that strong. Actually, I think it is the weakest in the region. Yeah, I think it's the weakest in the East region. Africa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uganda and then Tanzania. Tanzanian shilling is um, around two times bigger than ours. Sometimes yeah. two times, sometimes one point something or three maximum. Maximum. Same with Rwanda. Mm -hmm. 
and I think Sudanese currency is bigger than ours. Yeah, Sudanese. They South use, Sudan. They use dollars. I think, yeah, South Sudan dollar. dollar. Yeah. Yeah. And it is strong. That, yeah, it's very strong. That one is very strong. Yeah. So guys, we are uh, almost at the tasks. We are arriving. Yeah, at least you can be, people can be able to see them. Yeah, they are very popular, the tasks. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So whenever you search about Mombasa, this picture will always appear on your Google feed. Yeah. Yes. I'm sure there are many tourists there. Yeah, people come from all over to the take world. pictures here. Mm. Yeah, I'll give you a history about it. Okay, no problem. Yeah, so we can close over so that you can walk on that lane. Okay, okay. Yeah. So you can see how beautiful it is all the way with all these palms being aligned over here. These ones, eh? Yeah. Yeah. I can see. So is this on the opposite side a garden? Yeah, there is a, a garden, garden there. garden, eh? Yeah, there is a garden inside there. It's called Uhuru Park. Oh, like Nairobi? Yeah, like Nairobi. Wow, nice, nice, nice. You know, Nairobi is a mixture of different slangs, yeah. like English. They, they call them Sheng. Yeah, Sheng. <laughs> yes. Yeah, people have been teaching me in, in Kenya. So my Ugandan people, when I come back, me, I'll be speaking Swahili only. Yeah, people will not be understanding what you're saying. Yeah. Okay. So now we are at Mombasa, famous, the famous Mombasa tasks. Yeah. Yeah. And, uh... Before we show people, you can just give them the fact files about these. Okay. So, because of the direction of the sun. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, basically these tasks mm. uh, were constructed because of the... Previously, or initially, mm. they were made from wood. Wood? Yes. Okay. And then the palm leaves. The palm leaves? Yes. And uh, it was around 1954. Okay. When the lawyer family of England came to visit Kenya. And then the people of Mombasa decided to beautify where the queen would pass. Oh. He was going all the way to Kilindini Hamba. It's on this direction. Is there an airport? Uh, no, it, no, it's a harbor. Okay. So he was, she was going to stay at a yachting club. Oh. So the people of Mombasa decided, oh, you know the Queen of England is here, so let us beautify where she's going to. Yeah, to make something beautiful yeah. for her. And, uh, and after that, after she left, it became so popular that people decided to come here to take pictures. It started becoming a tourist attraction among us there, mm. the locals. Mm. So the municipality decided, ah, let us just uh, retain it as it is. Mm. for people to take pictures mm. and then after that you know the wood rots and because of the rain weather, the and rain, the weather yeah. Yeah. so they decided to construct this uh, metallic me no using aluminium oh yeah they are yeah, made yeah. out of aluminium. aluminium and then most people decided the uh, business people and travel agents decided you know what we are going to ditch uh, us associating ourselves with uh, Old Town and we start associating ourselves with the tasks of Mombasa and that's how they managed to become so popular. Oh yeah. yeah. So they were constructed 1950 50, uh, because of the visitation of the Queen, Queen. Elizabeth. Yes, yeah, that is how wow. they uh, initially that's how they... I love the creativity of these people. Yeah. <laughs> Where did they get the idea of the ivory? Why ivory? The tasks. I also ask myself, why? How? 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 No. Wait. The thing is, you know, they place the woods like this, and then after they, it was only one lane. Mm. Okay. It was only one lane. Okay. And then after they added another lane, mm. they said, okay, let's add another structure. Oh. So it decided. Okay. Now it became like okay, that lane and this lane, mm. they became two structures. So after that, they said, okay. Why should we continue replacing wood every now and then, every now and then? So let's just use metallic mm. to construct these ones. Mm. And then after constructing this one, by good luck or by 
whatever happened, it formed the first letter of the word Mombasa. That is M. By, by chance. By chance. <laughs> so you can see. That one is an M representing. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Man, man. So it's, it's so popular among us, the locals yeah. and also the international community. community. You can see right now, we don't have tourists here, but you can see there are local people who are taking pictures Yeah, they're taking selfies. It's so popular. Everyone wanna, in case you come to Mombasa, mm. everyone wants to come and visit these tasks. Wow. They mean a lot. So even me, I had to come and be here. Yeah. Man. Yeah. So, you know, people will say, oh, no, you didn't go to Mombasa. Show yeah. us when we will go to Mombasa. <laughs> and then you show them this picture. They say, oh, now we believe you are in Mombasa. Mm. So yeah. by the time the queen came, yes, it was only one lane. One lane. This other lane was created, was... Uh, Added after oh. a while now. Okay. And then they did put the both structures and they formed a... Later M. Like an M. Okay. Yeah, so guys, I'm here in Mombasa, Kenya, and I'm enjoying myself. I'm loving this city, Mombasa, behind the iconic tusks. These are a popular destination to all people who visit this part of Kenya. And UG Connect had to come here and show you around this beautiful city, popularly known as the blue and white city of Kenya, Mombasa. So right now, I think let's take them to Uhuru Park. What do you think? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We can go to show them the Uhuru Park. Mm. And then now we can go to Mamangina. Okay. Yeah. Mamangina. Wow. So, and then the thing is, mm. it was, I think it's, these things just happened by chance. Mm. Everything was happening by chance. Mm. After they constructed this one, Mm. The tasks, people mm. were coming to more more frequently to visit this place mm. and there was no place whereby after you visit here You, you rest. You, yeah, you rest. Mm. So they decided, okay, let's just construct a small park where people can come, relax, and chill. Eh? And chill yeah. yeah. Can you, only the noises of birds and bats will mm. annoy you when you're here, but everything <laughs> else it's How do you get annoyed by the noise of birds? <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's a music into your ears. Yeah, to me it's music in my ears. Yeah. So and, it, uh, it doesn't annoy me. Yeah, you can show them the municipality decided to plant indigenous trees. trees. These are all indigenous trees. Oh, look at those birds. Those They're are bats. bats. Those ones are bats. Mm. Yeah. So what is the name of this tree? Uh, let me not lie to you, I'm not a botanist. <laughs> 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 so you can see how nice and chill it is. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah. then benches. Mm. Yeah. Hello. So let me show you something, something unique. Uh huh. Yes, I want you to stand, go stand there, and okay. then you tell me what you're going to see. With the camera here? Yes, just go stand there. Okay. And then you look that side, you tell me what you're going to see. Okay. I look which side? That side. This way? Yes. Oh, I'm seeing the map of Africa. Yeah, good. <laughs> <laughs> good. <laughs> I'm seeing the map of Africa here, guys. Whoa. So, Everyone coming to visit this Uhuru Park, mm. you'll be able to spot your own country from here. Okay. Yeah. I can see East Africa is highlighted. Yeah, you East from Africa, the map. From the map. And uh, because of that, I can identify your country. All the East African countries, not only my country. Yes. Yeah. So this, the now this is the most unique thing about the park. The park, the map of Africa. Let's go and check it out. Yep. Uhuru Park. Guys, you should come and uh, explore Mombasa. So come and see something here. Okay. So now this one, the, uh, the plaque commemorates the official commissioning of the Uhuru Gardens. Mm. Uh -huh. Rehabilitated by Kenya Port Authority. Okay. Yeah, by the Minister for Transport and uh, 
Minister of Transport, Honorable. Yeah. Okay, that's the name of the. The Chirau Ali Makerele. Makerele. That is nine nine. Nineteen November. November two thousand and seven. Oh. Yeah. So. Long time. That time long I was, I think, in class four. Oh. Primary the, four in Uganda. The Uhuru Fountain, elected by public, contrib to commemorate the attainment of Kenya independence on twelfth December. 1963. So it's the public which contributed money yes. to put up this structure. This, this structure. Wow. So the thing is, this is when the country, 1963, mm. is when the country gained its internal independence. It wasn't yet a republic. Mm. This is when the country gained its internal independence. Now we can be able to rule ourselves. Mm. And then it became a republic in 1964. Oh. Yes. So that now we could be able to do all yeah. sorts of things by ourselves. As a country, as a, as country. a sovereign state. Yeah, as a sovereign state. Oh, bro, you know a lot of history. <laughs> <laughs> You're a true historian. <laughs> oh, guys, go and subscribe to this man's YouTube channel. Yeah. I'm leaving its link in the comment section below. Yes. Okay, so here is Africa. So here is the map of Africa. Africa Mashariki. Africa Mashariki. What does that mean? Africa Mashariki. Mm. Mashariki means east in Swahili. Peace. Mashariki means east in Swahili. Oh. So there is Mashariki Magaribi, Kusini, Kaskazini. Oh. So Kusini in South Africa, Kaskazini ni west, Kusini ni no, Kaskazini, Kusini. Wait. Why am I getting confused? <laughs> Kusini, Kaskazini, Mashariki. Yes. Magaribi? Magaribi, yes. Yeah. Magaribi is west. West, eh? West. Okay. So, here's the map of East Africa. You can see there. This is Somalia. This is Somali, Somali, Somaliland. Yeah. The Somaliland. Mm. It has the longest coastline. Mm. And then there we have Ethiopia. Ethiopia. There we have Kenya. Kenya. Here, where we are. The, we are in Kenya. We are, we are around somewhere here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We are yeah. around somewhere Actually, here. Actually, we are around here. We are around here. Yeah. Yeah. So, and then that is the Lake Trukana. That mm. is Victoria. Mm. Now then, then we go to Uganda and Tanzania. Mm. Uh, is then it Mal Malawi? Malawi? Malawi, yes. Mozambique here. Mozambique. This one is Mozambique, not so? Mozambique, yes. Yeah, Mozambique. And then we go to Congo. Yeah, Congo, the biggest country, Bigger in, Africa. country in Africa. Then we have Rwanda here. Yes. Rwanda and Burundi. But they only put Rwanda only. Only. They didn't put uh, Burundi. Burundi. Maybe by that time, Burundi was not a sovereign state. I, maybe, maybe, maybe. Could be, could be. Could be. So, now here. So, this one was Sudan. Now, this one was Sudan. Before the division oh, of South Sudan. Before the division, and it became two countries. Okay. Yes. Then this one is Djibouti. Djibouti. Djibouti and Eritrea. Where is Eritrea? So now we are here at Somaliland. Mm. Now we are at, I think Djibouti is somewhere around here. Mm. And then, is it Djibouti and then Eritrea? Okay, so you are boarding a tuk tuk. Okay. Do you know this is my first time sitting in a tuk tuk? In a tuk tuk? Yeah. <laughs> so you let me know what is your experience. <laughs> we use these ones every day to commute. Sure. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> Ooh, my but they are, they are very efficient and hey. very quick. Okay. Yeah. So you use your phone to record it? Eh? Yeah. I Mimi, could I enjoy Mombasa? Okay. Hey. <laughs> this one is the work of uh, Mombasa Cement, Kenya. There is a company that 
uh, produces cement or manufactures cement here in Mombasa. Okay. The one that is responsible for the beautification of Mombasa. Oh wow. Yeah, so if you see these all wild animals, water oh, animals. The, even the elephants I saw the, yeah, at the roundabout. Yeah, that is the, his work. Okay. Yeah. Nice. So he has been doing all these purifications just from the deep, from the heart. Okay. Yeah. From wow. the goodness of his heart. Himself. Himself. <laughs> now we don't say he, he will sell we say himself. Himself. <laughs> <laughs> Are you Kenyan? <laughs> it's never a dull day here in Kenya. Yeah. So everyone just does everything just to be happy. Just to be himself. Yeah. <laughs> is this a market? Yeah. This is just an open air market. Okay. Evening market? Yeah. If, no. It's a all every the time. day, all the time. Oh. Uh, you know, the, where, okay, I'll show you. Uh, this is where, like, uh, the people, who, the middle class people where they live, okay. they live on the other side of the, the okay. island. Okay. So when they are coming off from work in the, from the island, they pass over here to buy bananas, clothes. So you mean we are on the island? Yeah, right now we are on the island. <laughs> are you sure? Yes. We are surrounded by water? Yes. But I didn't see how we got past water. Huh? I didn't say bridge. Uh, uh, this one has uh, so, so Mombasa is an island? We are, yeah, yes, it's an, an island. island. <laughs> so what is the name of this place? Li now we are going to Likoni. They just say Likoni. Likoni? Likoni. Oh. Likoni Ferry. Likoni Ferry. I remember the car which drowned yeah. like five years back. Yeah. Is it five years? They With a are... mother and a daughter. Not five years ago. I think maybe, was it two three? years? Maybe one year, one no, year and a half. It's not two. one. Yeah. It's like three years at least. Okay. Ah, but I was still in Nairobi that time. Do people eat these apples? I, no, I don't think so. These ones have gone bad. Yeah, those are, I, yeah, they are bad. Mm. ferry, I remember. That's how I came to know about the ferry. The ferry? Yeah. Okay. The woman who died. Bro, yeah. I need some water. We need some water, okay. Yeah. Cold, eh? Cold. Mm. This one, is this, is this a good brand? Mm. How much is that? But I don't think that is... This one doesn't have a seal. Yeah, it doesn't I, have I a seal. I want to buy one with a seal. Okay. You buy here? Uh, yeah, I think this one. Hello. Maji. Oh, he's feeding his baby. You want the big one or the small one? I want the small one. The small one. Kidogo. Kidogo. Baridi. How much is it? I think if I think 25 or that. Pesangapi. 25. 25.